What's good, YouTube? It is now 8.57 a.m. Today is like Christmas come early for me. 600, count them, 600 grams of carbs today. Today is my refeed day. Three weeks out from Naba, North Britain. Five weeks out from the body power men's physique that I'll be doing. So today um, it's going to be 600 grams of carbs, 200 grams of protein, and fats will probably be under 30. Um, so like I say it's now 8:58. Um, so I'm going to just go and hit some cardio. Going to report in for breakfast, first meal of the day. Okay, guys. So we've got cardio done. Got Charmander looking fly as fuck. Meal one. It's going to be time for some breakfast. Big ass breakfast. Going to head up to my girlfriend's now, where I've got all my food up there. So I'll be checking in shortly with breakfast meal one. So we're finally at breakfast. What time is it, Connie? 17 minutes past 11, I've been up a long ass time with no food. So we've got these pasta box overs, Connie. We've got some cereal, not quite Lucky Charms, but the next best thing, because it was cheaper. We've got these are marshmallow meaties. So we've got 100 grams of these, which works out at 100 grams of these is, watch the carbs, 83 grams of carbs and um, so we've got those okay pretty fly for a wake up then we'll just wash this rice krispies bar which are like 14 grams of carbs in so you're looking at um with the milk you know 100 grams of carbs right there so i'm going to eat this connie's got on some eggs for me i'll only just have um just the one yolk this morning i normally have full eggs but it's low fat so i'm gonna have just one yolk um and eight egg whites which will take like 30 grams of protein from the eggs then a little bit of protein from this so we're looking at about 40 36 to 40 grams of protein so i'm still hungry after this and um, i'll probably be having um cinnamon and raisin bagel and then i've got some cereal bars and things like that and yeah with some pasta for later so I'll see how I get on with this meal. Oh, I've got some cream of wheat as well. So that's meal one. I'll put the macros in the description or on screen. Let's check back for meal numero two later on. So you've got uh, the next part of breakfast, which is the eggs. One full egg, um, eight egg whites, so nine in total. And the toxin at about 30 grams of protein. So I'm going to munch on this, and then that's breakfast done. And then now finally finish breakfast up, we've got some a sachet of um, cream of wheat, maple syrup, brown sugar. So never had this before, Connie's been kind enough to cook it for me. Look at this steaming hot, steaming smoking hot. I'm going to look forward to digging into this. I think it's going to be a little bit like the ground rice that I make, but um, I'm going to have this now, see what it's like. And then this concludes breakfast, meal one, the time is now, what time is it Connie? Half past 11, probably have my next meal around half one, two o'clock-ish, so um, stay tuned for that, guys. Okay, guys, so we've got a little snack here, Kellogg's Nutri-Grain, breakfast bake, protein, 31, 31 grams of carbs, four grams of fat. Going to have this just to time me over until the next big meal. Hopefully, it's not a bit of uh, disappointment. Look at that shit, guys. I got it right there. In the words of POG, G A F are in the words of Shreddy. This is banging. Look at that. Look at that, guys. Absolutely banging. Mm. Tastes good. Is good. So we've got the next meal coming up guys and it is, what time is it Connie? It's about half past two so a little bit later than what I thought but still in that crucial bro three hour gap so we've got some 
um, diced turkey breast, some um, wraps, a little bit of um, low fat sauce there just for some flavour. So I'm going to have this and you're looking at about 42 grams of carbs, let's say 45 with the sauce. Um, protein probably is around 40 or so. So I'm going to have this, going to eat it, going to enjoy it and then we'll check back in for the next meal. So this is just meal two of the day, like I said, a little bit later than what I thought. Just got done with the wraps and the turkey. Just add some brioche, I was going to have two slices, ate the first slice, not that good, so I've only had one, it's actually 15 grams of carbs, 42 grams of carbs, so combined, you're looking at about 57 grams of carbs there with the sauce, that's round up to 60, and that's that meal done, um, going to have a couple of pancakes now, so I'll bring those shortly. Just add one bagel, cinnamon raisin, 45 grams of carbs, a little bit of jam on, so let's call it 50 grams of carbs from that right there, and that is that done. Next big meal will be pasta, which will be the last carb meal of the day. Might have a couple more, so I need 100 grams uh, carbs more, not including the pasta meal, so I'll probably have a little bit more um, snacks through the day, so that's that. Um, let's, chew, let's stay tuned for the next meal. I've got my last meal of the day planned, which is a pasta bake. I've got another 90 grams of carbs to play with this at 5 o'clock. I'll probably be going the next meal in about an hour or so. So I might um, just have like a mega carb meal. Uh, maybe have some bagels or cereal after that. I'm not too sure yet. I'll show you whatever I have. Um, but that's it. Um, today, all I've done is cardio this morning. Some abs. Wanted to go to the tanning salon, but never got around to it. Fell asleep. Um, just here. On the laptop, gonna get, gonna just take out some business and little browse the internet, um, and that's it for now. I'll report back shortly with the next meal update. But this day has been pretty good for, um, you know, I've been feeling tired the last week or so. Absolutely not good. So I've not been on nap there, but um, the food is definitely gonna help out. The foods I've had have been pretty good. Um, Something a little bit different, something sort of care me sweet tooth a little bit as well. Three weeks out today until the Mabin Hopper. So it's the last sort of stretch now, three weeks to go. I made big improvements in the last three weeks of the November, the October, November show last year. So I'm hoping to try and replicate, um, not duplicate, the same type of thing. It's all going to be all good if I can do it. It's going to be some good, sweet shit. And as I like to say today, there's been some sweet foods in there. Keep your tooth sweet, bitches make you feel all good. That's how I like to how I like to put it. So that's it guys. Stay tuned. See you all in the next clip. So it's time for the big meal of the day and this looks un fucking real. Let's check it out guys. So you've got pasta, some chicken, got some uh, tomato, like a flatbread. What is it called? Like a tomato flatbread? Oh, it looks fucking unreal. I'm not had pasta in ages, so I'm going to dig into this. Macros for this meal come to including the bread. And I've got a little bit of um, rice pudding after, which I'll show you when it's done. Comes to 160 grams of carbs, 40 something protein, about 10 grams of fat. I'll put them on screen. I'm going to eat this now. See you all soon. So this is rounding the last meal off, guys. We've got some rice pudding here. Got some jam. And this jam right here is also the same type of jam that I'll use um, the, the day before show or the day of a show um, when I'm doing a carb loading, which is similar to sort of what I've done today, but the foods are slightly different. Um, I'll use this on rice crackers, uh, rice cakes, sorry. Um, tastes good. And this brand, Meridian, um, I got from Holland and Barrett, but I think you get from Tesco and places like that. Also, do um, an awesome natural peanut butter. All natural, just like natty peanut butter, natty shreddy. And they do a good almond butter as well, like Connie um, has found out. So you can get them from there, or I'll get my proteins, peanut butter. I think it's basically all made in the same factory, but you know, if you just want one tub of it or whatever, and you don't need to put an order in at my protein or online, you can just nip down to the shop and get some of that. So yeah, I'm going to put some of this in some of that. And then I probably got around 70 grams of carbs left for the day. Now that pasta was gone, lickety split like that. It was finger licking good. 
tasted absolutely unreal. So, like I say, the time now is about quarter past six or something. Um, I've still 70 grams of carbs left, so I'll probably have some cream of wheat or cream of rice. Maybe as a bagel, but I'll probably just have the rice or the um, cream of wheat. Protein, I've got probably left of 60 grams or so for the dinner. I think it's a bit less, maybe 50 or so. Um, the macros go in the description or whatever. Um, but yeah, looking forward to this, hitting that sweet tooth. So stay tuned for more, guys. See you all soon. Now that's just a glorious mess. The sticky fingers right there look at that gonna taste unreal this is the last seven of carbs right here guys 26 grams it's about quarter to seven seven o'clock and um, having this now last lot of carbs and then I probably have a protein shake later before bed and that'll be me done for the day so stay tuned for the entire rundown of macros and all that funky jazz stay tuned guys so completely forgot to film the last meal that I had but all it was was um, a protein shake uh, it was actually a beef protein beef hydrolyzed protein shake never had one before but my protein sent me out um, a sample so I uh, opened that up had it um, chocolate flavor 44 grams of protein very low fats very low carbs so pretty good shake to have to end off the day and um, I'll put a picture up on screen of it somewhere but that was it guys, that is my full day's worth of eating the refeed day. It's now just before 12 o'clock, I'm going to be headed into bed soon. The last car meal was around half six, seven-ish, about half six, seven o'clock I think it was, about half six. Um, and then the only thing I had since then was just the protein shake. And that's it, refeed day done, 600 grams of carbs, hit just, just short of it. Protein, 200 grams of carbs and my fat was pretty low, clocking in probably around 30, maybe just over. Um, and that was it. So just a couple of thoughts on my refeed day was I can see how people confuse a refeed day with a cheat day um, and if people want to use a refeed day as a cheat day by all means you know you've got your own goals you've got your own life go ahead and do whatever you want to do people who have you know that if it fits your macros type diet flexible diet and whatever it is to me it's all gimmicky um, if you want the best results, you eat the best foods. You know you don't see bodybuilders training um, for competition prep. Like it's not the top level bodybuilders having things like pop tarts, um, candies, things like that. But if you're not competing, you know if you're not at that level and you've got a good physique and you're just doing like little shows and things like that, by all means have a pop tart, whatever. I don't know why pop tarts are so popular, but um, you know just have whatever you want. Um, the next time I do one of these days, I would do it a little bit different. The breakfast, I would have something very similar um, to what I had today, but then I would knock the pancakes out. I wouldn't have those. Um, you know, I would have the breakfast, the sugary type of breakfast, and the rest of the day I would probably stick to, you know, the cereal bars. I would still include them. Um, I would have probably white rice, cream of rice, ground rice, more sort of white rice in the diet, maybe instead of the wraps, I still have the pasta in there. So it would be similar but slightly different, but like I said, it's the first time I've done a refeed day um, to this degree and these types of foods and things like that. And it's been a good day, um, just breakfast alone sort of cared me uh, cravings for anything sugary with the malt uh, marshmallow malt, basically the Lucky Charm rip offs, the cheap, um, the budget value Lucky Charms. But all in all, pretty good day. Good day of eating. I've enjoyed it. Tomorrow, um, back to 450 grams of carbs. Tomorrow is heavy legs, uh, high volume shoulder in the afternoon, heavy legs on the evening. So I'm looking forward to that. Being like I say, good day of eating. I've enjoyed it. I will see how I look in a couple of days' time. Don't think I'll weigh myself in the morning. I'm not expecting to look that great in the morning, but you know. Hopefully, three weeks left to go now. This was my full day of eating, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, all you need to do is leave a comment down below, hit that thumbs up button, like the video. Like the video if you've noticed. Oh, this is gone since the last meal. That's damn right, I shaved. Um, you know, subscribe, head over to trainingbreak.com, follow me on Twitter, follow me on Facebook. And that's all I've got to say, guys. Thank you for watching the video. I'm Adam. Until the next Shreddy Brick video, keep clanging and banging.